Our commuters have just been positive. They love the new system, they love its speed, its uh, reliability, safety, um, and uh, we've generally had very positive feedback from commuters. What measures have been put in place to reduce the environmental impacts of the system? Well, let me just say that we, from the beginning we planned Rio Vire to be something which is um, very uh, low, uh, low emissions, let, let's just say. Uh, part of our Rio Vire brand is that it will be promoting like a clean air environment. Um, we got Euro 4 buses with a particle trap, which um, are some of the cleanest in the world. Also, you know, the way that our stations are designed, they may be designed like to be also like friendly, um, a lot of glass, so you don't need electricity in the day. Um, also the glass helps with safety. There's CCTV cameras in the stations, um, and there's also CCTV cameras on the buses, and they're all linked up to a control room, so at any point in time, there are people in the control room watching what's happening in the station. We also have at each station three security there, both mostly involved around physical security and also helping, you know, particularly now because we've got an interim fair collection, so just watching that there's no people trying to get on the buses without paying. The other issue, though, that we are concerned about is pedestrian safety. It, it really requires not so much a physical thing, but really education and awareness. You know, you still see children, you know, playing on the dedicated lanes and, and things like that, because it's such a new form of infrastructure. Um, but we are going to roll out sort of pedestrian education campaigns at the schools and the environments of the stations.